Hey, it's Annie. Today, I don't know what I'm doing. Today, I am going to attempt to depot my Jaclyn Hill palette. I mentioned this a while ago that I was gonna do that and I never did it, but I'm, I'm gonna do that today. The reason that I wanted to pot this is I just feel like, I don't like the palette. Now, I got the original one. They sell it in Ulta right now. And the cover is different. It's shinier, so it's probably easier to take care of. But this is just, you can't see it here. You see, see how grody it is? See how grody and dirty? It just got really dirty. And I love, love, love this palette. I went on Ulta and I ordered a couple of the magnetic palettes here. And I got the little tool thing to get these out. Um, I don't know how this is gonna go. I've never depotted anything before, so I don't know how this is gonna work, but we're gonna try it, we're gonna do it. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and take the shadows out. Like I said, I got two of these, hopefully that'll be enough. But the nice thing is, if I wanna travel with this, I can just put this in a bag and travel with it. Um, if I wanted to change it out, put different ones in here, whatever, you know what I mean? So. I'm really excited to do this. So let's get into this. I'm gonna set the camera up so we can see what I'm doing in case you decide to attempt to do this yourself, okay? Let's get into it. All right, hopefully you can see this good. I don't know if I can just lift these out or not and depot it. Um, I don't know what's underneath here, so I don't know which end you use. Let's try this one. See if that's gonna pop out. Cause this is what I'd like to be able to do. Oh, got one. Let's try this one. So I'm just going right in the corner here. I don't know if you could see that. I'm just trying to be as careful as so it's cracking a little bit. So be, if you do this, you're at your own risk, okay? I know I have to be careful here. Be really careful. Oh, it's cr my, the color's cracking a little bit. Dang it. That one cracked a little bit. But it's not a color I wear all the time, so I'm not going to pack. I'm just going to put that aside for now. Okay, so let me get into this one. So I would say just be really gentle. Oh, crud. Okay. This is like nothing you, you want to hurry to do. Some of these are really coming out though. That one's coming out good. And that one doesn't have any of the glue on the bottom, so that's nice. Here's this one. I'm just going to go really gentle here because um, I can see what I'm doing this. It wants to crack. Wow. It really wants to crack there. Mm. Trying to be gentle. Let me turn it this way here. And you can still see. So this isn't really a tutorial on like this is what you do. This is like you're just watching me do it basically. <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's cracking. Just trying to, I know it looks like I'm really forcing it, but I'm actually, I'm trying to be really gentle here. Okay, I'm gonna have to fix that one. Wonder that came off. I wonder if there's another way. See, I don't know. There's so many layers to this. I don't know if there's another way to get to this. Let me see. So like if I go underneath here, let's see what happens if I go underneath here. Okay. In case you were wondering, this looks like broken. There we go. Oh, 
Um, and then we've got this layer here. So let me see what happens if I take some of this up. I just don't want to keep on cracking the shadows, you know? So I might have to just peel this off the backing. Do you see that? Let's see what happens. Now there's lots of layers to this. Okay, so now I'm seeing here, I can see um, the little layers of cardboard. So is there a way to get in here? Ooh, see what happens if I can take that off. So I'm just using this little spatula. Oh yeah, this might make it a lot easier. So let me see if I can get this off here. So I think, oh my goodness. Do you see that? Where you can see it's a lot, probably we'll be able to get those out maybe easier and maybe not crack anymore. So I'm gonna just peel this off if I can. And now that I got a little bit of that off, let's see. Let me get this one off too. Okay, so let me see. This will come up easier. Oh yeah, that's much better. I should have done that in the first place. Because it looks like much better. I will have to peel the glue off of the back of it. See that? Um, let's see if I can get this one off like I did that other one. So that is the key. I think if you go through and take this top part off, you probably, and I'll see as I do this, but it looks like, um, boy, this is tricky because it's all taped here. I gotta get the rest of this off here. Let me see if I can get in here. I'm trying to be careful. But I feel like if I could get this top layer off here, I'll be able to get the shadows off a lot easier. Let me take this one out before I mess that up. This one up, or should I wait? Yeah, I just don't want to ruin anything. So that this is kind of a messy project here. I'm destroying the Jaclyn Hill palette. No, not really. <laughs> Oh, I see like a piece of metal right here. Oh, that was probably where it was attached in the back, I bet. Oh my goodness, all the layers. Okay, let me see if I can lift it here. Some areas are just glued a little bit more. Mm-hmm. 
and I want to be a little bit more careful but I'm gonna to try to get the tape off the rest of this. Actually that wasn't the black that was green so I may have lost a color because I did that but honestly I don't think it's a color I really would have been using much anyway so I'm not really sad about it but I may try to see if I can fix that I don't know I feel like I need to wash my hands up because I feel like I've got like... I'm going to wash my hands and I'll be right back. So I think the reason that that cracked honestly was because of the way I took it out in the beginning. Um, I thought there was another one that, a couple other ones that might be an issue. Find out. I'm going to leave these to this. Oh, that one's, yeah, that one's on there. So I can put a magnet on this one. And hopefully there's enough magnets on here. I did order two of these pallets, so. Um, do I have another one that doesn't? I guess I should have checked that first. Here we go. Here we go. This one I kind of did stupid. I didn't get it on there exact. Take this off of the bottom. See that? So that really, the glue on the bottom seems to come off really pretty easily. Which is nice. Yes, there we go. See how we're going to be neater. There we go. Okay, so that is it, you guys. I still have some more that I have to, I have to see if I can fix that one. And I do have some other magnets because I bought two of these palettes. But that's it. So, there you go. Thanks so much for joining me. And I will see you real soon. I will leave the links below too with the where I purchased these. So, if you're interested, I will leave it below. And that is it. Thanks so much for joining me. I will see you soon. Bye.